<laughs> my trains of work probably told me that the file size had been reached. Just like my Canon 60D does. Yay. So I guess this will be a two-parter. The first part I'll put in the description. And while this is booting up, if you could do me a huge favor and give the like button a little click, I appreciate it. It helps out a lot. It really does. And a lot of people request videos like this where they're unedited, pretty much raw. Me showing you step by step without editing. I prefer editing because it makes the video much shorter. And if I make a mistake, I can just cut it and fix it. And y'all you know, y'all never see it. Unless I purposely leave it in the video. Which I do sometimes, so that way you know how to troubleshoot. But then while it's booting up, I fast forward. Nobody wants to sit through all this. I can't believe this thing has a file size limit. I've never recorded this long with my Prime. I wish the autofocus would stop doing that. Stop. My Prime is really hot now. You just stay focused. See, when you record your phone at an angle like this, only certain parts of the screen are in focus. So that's why I like I do my videos like this, where it's pointed straight at the phone or straight up and down. I'm actually getting a tripod that has a crane arm on it. So instead of doing it the ghetto method that I do it. It'll do it properly. Stop freaking. <laughs> Are you going to play nice and just stay in focus like that? This is taking a good minute. The first boot always does. But fortunately, I save y'all time by speeding it up and not making you wait through it. Kind of got no choice. <gasps> the keys. Oh, it vibrated. Do we have ice cream sandwich? Do we? This is the works of Viper Boy, um, Joel's. Uh, Chad Goodman's doing a kernel for it. This is the work of a lot of people. You'll notice right away, this is Virgin Mobile, and as of right now, there's no way to change that. But, it works on Sprint just fine. And you're seeing it here first. This is Ice Cream Sandwich on the HTC EVO 3D, and it booted for me just fine. I won't make this video as long as the other one. And when I get home, I'll try to, I'll pull out my Canon 60D and then edit the video at the Dell Premiere and walk around the ROM, because, uh, I won't be able to do anything until about, I won't be able to start recording until about 2 p.m. Central Time. So I'll have plenty of time to play with this and you get the new little thing down here. This is since 3.6, I believe. Ooh, ice cream sandwich. <laughs> I like that a lot. I'll turn 4G on. Just tap it. Cool. About phone. Network software Android 4.0.3 since 3.6 Viper ROM beta 1. Advanced 
Don't notify me. Keep Wi-Fi on during sleep. Look at that, 4G connected, and I'm getting a better signal than normal, too. It's got the TDM backup on it, and Wi-Fi tether. Sweet. Thank you, Viper Boy. Thank you. Because it should... Okay. I'm going to restart real quick to see if it clears up some of those issues. This should not take nearly as long. And now we'll definitely keep you guys up to date with this. I'm getting the Evo 4G LTE when it comes out, and I will still do videos on this phone. Anytime something awesome happens, I'll be, I'll be right here to cover it. And my upgrade is July 1st, and the Evo 4 GLT comes out before then. So I'll actually be using my July 1st upgrade to get the Galaxy S3 when it comes to Sprint. 4.8 inches of screen, I think the Galaxy S3 is going to be awesome. So I'll have this, Evo 4 GLT, and Galaxy S3. My wife has a Galaxy Nexus. I will do comparison videos to this and the Galaxy Nexus. I'll do comparison videos between this and you know, any other device y'all want to see, just let me know in the comments. Alright. Let's see now. If Titanium Backup has any errors. Okay. It's just Titanium Backup. We'll start Tether. Start. Please ask for a root. Why didn't you ask for a root? Okay, I might need to install that. Oh, that zip's still on there. The SU fix thing does fix it, but I don't know if I screw something up by doing things the way I did. But there is root, it does work. I'm going to end this video because of time restraints, but I'll definitely post another one and keep you guys up to date on this. For more videos on the EVO 3D, EVO 4G LTE, Galaxy S3, uh, Galaxy Nexus, Transformer Prime, HP Touchpad, Galaxy Tab, Please subscribe. And if you haven't already, please give this video a thumbs up. I appreciate it a lot. This is What Would Josh Do? And this has been a first look at Ice Cream Sandwich. Official. Everything works. Camera. And you can switch to 3D, and 3D works too. Look at that. Looks all funky on camera, of course, but 3D does work, and there's the new camera. Anyways, this is what would Josh do. Please subscribe. I'm out.